Let me give you an example of a, what I think is a really great school um, where diversity has become a resource for learning. Years ago I was uh, Deputy uh, Director General of Education Queensland and I used to travel around uh, the schools a lot. I went to a, uh, a primary school in Mount Isa and it just so happened that the classroom that I went into, the teacher had be previously been a teacher of the deaf. Uh, so she was uh, fluent in Auslan and sign English. And being Mount Isa, there was a large Indigenous population in the school and the Indigenous students were uh, so, um, often, oftentimes had otitis uh, uh, medium, which is a, a, a compromises their hearing. Uh, so the teacher uh, taught all of the students in her classroom how to sign. So that bridges a, a gap that there might have been between the hearing students and those who were uh, hard of hearing. Uh, but beyond that, what she then did was have the students teach other classes right across the school how to sign. So the students became the teachers. Uh, so that built up their, their repertoire of skills. Uh, she then uh, instituted a program for the community where the students and teachers would be taking classes, uh, sign language classes, into the Mount Isaac community. Uh, and in those small steps, so many things were happening. When I went into the classroom, it, it wasn't a remarkable thing that they were signing uh, and talking. Um, it was just the way things happened there. And, but remarkable things had happened because of that. The, uh, the students had to learn something, but they had to demonstrate their knowledge by teaching others, and so it went.